be part of this uh, team, uh, cleaning this stadium, uh, I think is the best experience of my life. You never know how far you can go with Gianni King uh, on these 25 years. I, I don't, I, I'm speechless to say the experience I got with this company. I remember my, my first stadium was for, uh, I think, capacity 2,500 people. I never, I never imagined cleaning something like, like this stadium, the best stadium, cleaned by the best company. My area, it's event level, Hall of Fame, Bowl 100 and 300. And in then the second area, we got a the franchise owner. They are in charge to clean the whole main concourse and this level, the 200 bowl. We got one more person that are in charge of all the mezzanines and uh, all the access to the upper concourse. We got another uh, franchise owner that are in charge to clean the whole parking lot from the very beginning to the end of this game. I've been a franchisee for 10 years and I've invested in it because I wanted to be a business owner. Um, I did not at the time have the capital to go and, and start up a business from scratch. Uh, I needed the assistance. Jenny King provided the assistance. Um, they've provided the marketing and they've provided you know the accounts for me. So um, it's you know partnering up with them and becoming a franchisee and, and a business owner. It's something that I've always wanted to do. Being a franchise owner in Dallas, uh, people are going to recognize the House of Blues, the Dallas Mavericks, Lone Star Park in Grand Prairie, uh, Cowboy Stadium out in Arlington. Uh, so being able to tell people that I am a franchise owner of Janney King and, and cleaning those facilities, it's an honor and it's recognition from Janney King and by the people of Dallas. In maintaining the accounts and being in good standing, I mean, Janney King's going to help me grow and fulfilling some dreams that I have. This is a big project to tackle. It really is. House of Blues is huge and it's a lot of different things. Being a concert venue, we have two kitchens, we have uh, multiple dining areas, so it's a lot to cover, a lot of real estate. Um, you know, so the fact that they're able to do all that and, and be successful at it is, to me is, is huge. It takes a lot, it really does. Um, we have, I always say, it's a lot of real estate to cover even in the kitchen. Our line is huge. We have a pizza oven, a broil, a flat top. Um, so to come in the next morning and, and that be completely spotless is kind of a luxury for us. I always tell my cooks they're completely spoiled. You know, they don't have to see what goes on and what Danny King does. You know, and they are really knowledgeable with the equipment. They're really good with all our stuff. And they're also really responsive, which is nice. When I, you know, have an area that I would like a little extra attention or when we have our corporate inspection, they work really well with us to do whatever we ask. I think everybody on Janikin, they need, they need to believe in their own dream. If you don't have a dream, you don't have a goals. R uh, right here with Janikin, I think I make my dreams come true. And I don't know where's the end of this career. We put a lot of pressure on Jan and King because we had a tightened uh, move-in schedule. We had to have the building operational before December 31st, 2010 in order for us to get our license. So we took the building in October. Uh, that means if they had about a two-week period to get this building patient ready. And they worked 24 hours, seven days a week, just like we did to try to get this building open. So it was a, a concerted effort with everybody working on it. The franchise owners are directly involved in our day-to-day -day operations. The regional support from not only the headquarters but also from the operations side of Janney King is vital to our success and they are always responding to our questions. Any kind of concerns we have, they're right there and uh, they've just been a, a wonderful resource for us to have day in and day out.